Hello and welcome to the TomCast. I'm Tom, president and dictator for life of 515comics.com. Uh, so as you may have seen uh, by the title of the video, I done crashed my trike on my way home from work this very day. So this was my fourth of ten Tom trikes to work ten times. On the way home, I, uh, I flipped the trike over for uh, a couple of dumb reasons. Let me kind of explain to you what happened. So, I was coming home, and I was actually coming home a slightly different route, which I thought would be safer. It was more side streets, less busy streets, on my way to get back to the trail that I take the bulk of the way to and from work. Anyhow, so I was taking what I believe to be a safer route back home, and it was. There was very little traffic. Uh, I come down this big hill and I turn onto a nice quiet side street and lo and behold there are no cars. It is very peaceful, it is very nice. Uh, but there is a speed capture device several blocks down the street and I think to myself, hey, wouldn't it be cool if I like saw how fast I could go? Bad idea. I start kicking it into gear and try and get going as fast as I can. Just as an aside, uh, on a trike, uh, on my trike anyway, you can't really go that fast. I mean, I got going pretty fast, but you really can't go that fast, so, and I already knew that. So I don't know, like, what I was trying to do. I was not going to break 25, it was pretty flat, and uh, I didn't really have, like, a good set of momentum before I started kicking it into gear, so I really don't know how fast I thought I'd be able to get it, but... It wouldn't have been anything, like, impressive. So that's part of why this was so stupid. So I'm kicking it into gear. I get up to 19, 20. I'm teetering between those two, and I'm like, Haha, this is so fun. I'm going so fast. And I hit a little bump, and my water bottle pops right out of its holder. Now, it's a little hard to describe. Maybe I'll just take a picture and show you guys. Uh, the water bottle holder is near the front of the bike, and your water bottle just goes in horizontal to the ground because there's really no other place to put it unless you put it in the backpack of the bike and then you can't drink while you're riding. So anyway, uh, it doesn't take much to get the thing to pop out of there. It pops out, I immediately hit the brakes so that I can stop and grab it, which in a normal bike would be totally fine. Like, you know, even if you were going 19, 20 miles an hour, like if you hit the brakes on a normal bike, like not too hard, but you hit the brakes pretty hard. You probably wouldn't get sent end over end. Uh, however, <laughs> the trike has disc brakes, which means if you really give it to the brakes, like even a little bit, they're stopping. You're stopping. Uh, but they're only on the front two wheels of the bike. So that means I hit the brakes with some alarm thinking, oh, I need to get my, my water bottle. It fell. And... The back end of the bike rose up immediately, and then the whole bike just sort of flipped to the left, and I went with it, and we turned completely around, and I, I done, uh, done skinned up my, my elbow pretty bad, uh, but the only damage to me was pretty much on my elbow, maybe my pride a little bit, but uh, otherwise my helmet, my gloves and everything uh, kept me pretty much safe from harm. The trike was in really fine shape. It didn't seem to have anything wrong with it, but uh, my mirror um, took the brunt. So this met, met the pavement uh, in a pretty big way. That was my adventure today, and I just wanted to share that with you guys. So I will be continuing Tom Trikes to work 10 times. Uh, so that I can get my sweet treat, and so that all of you can get your sweet treat once I have triked to work ten times this year. But, uh, but yeah, I definitely need to, need to replace this uh, before I go back out, because this is a very useful piece of equipment. Um, and, uh, yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to uh, be a bit smarter as I'm out there on the roads, so... If you didn't catch it, I did a vlog earlier this week talking about all of the work that I got done for Next Two's Volume 3. If you haven't, check that out. I hope you guys have a great weekend. If you're out there riding bikes, don't be a dummy like me. Ride safely. Uh, have a great weekend, and I will talk to you guys next time.